about kids in sports. Yeah. So basically, um, we know how we like to celebrate. We like to talk. We like to go, yeah. yeah. Or we like to say, oh, yeah, the small. Too small and like, all of that, you know, like right? Jordan stood this back in the day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Tiger Woods got the chair and all that stuff. Yeah. But now a lot of kids are doing it in organized basketball. Yeah, a lot of you. Yeah, they're yeah. not just doing it. They're doing it in organized Even basketball. our students, too, every time they get an A1 layup, yeah, one, they look yeah, at yeah, them, right, that, all, yeah. all of that stuff. So, yeah. what, so what are your thoughts on uh, student athletes or just kids in general taunting other players when they score a bucket or they cross them up or make a layup? Do you think it's right? Do you think it's foul? Do you think it's out of bounds? Let us know. What do you think? I think it brings intensity and entertainment to the game. Yeah. yeah. You know what I mean? Of course, you want kids to be humble and role models, but yeah. eventually, you know what I mean? You're going to get confident and, yeah. you know, you, you want to clap it up and get yeah, everybody yeah. ready. So, of course, kids are going to follow what they see on TV yeah, yeah. or what their parents do. You know, be, they're their role models. Yeah. Athletes are role models to the younger generation. Yeah. So, I'm all for the good in, in, intensity. And I believe that it, 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 it gives kids tough skin. Okay. It gives kids tough skin and, and, and um, tough mental mental awareness. Like, yeah. listen, when things don't go away, you can't just give up and cry. Yeah, yeah. you're used to this. You're, you're, just, you're used to the crowd. <laughs> yeah. You're used to different players. Yeah. So, now, I'm, am I all for the kids like getting physical with each other and fighting stuff like that? Nah. But I'm all for good intensity basketball, strong mental awareness, making toughness too. The kids tough. So I'm yeah. all for. I'm all for the entertainment and all of that. Yeah, and I'm gonna egg it on too. Yeah. I disagree okay, again. Okay, okay, I okay. disagree okay. again. Yeah. All right. So I do like I do like intense basketball. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like kids competing, mm -hmm. but it sends the wrong message when kids are in each other's faces doing this and that. However, it sends the wrong message. What do you say when a kid? What you, you think it's gonna get better? So oh. if a kid, if a kid is doing this at the age of 10, 11, 12, doing oh I'm better than you in your in your face, things gonna get better when they get in high school. Things gonna get better when they get in college. Get used to it. Start start them young. But that's a tech. They get a text for that. They get a text in those. They get a text of organized basketball for doing that. Yeah. So why? So why is that a good behavior for them to continue doing that? I think it's all a part of the game and entertainment wise too. And you know, it's a feeling. Basketball is emotion. Sports is emotion. So it of is. course, if you you get an air one and the crowd is going, you're gonna show that passion for the game. So that's why I'm all for the entertainment okay, cool. and the passion of the game and mental toughness. Okay, cool. That, that's cool for the kids doing it. But then when they get a technical foul or they get thrown out the game, that's also a part of the game too. So that's a Tec them taunting is a part of the game, but them also getting technical and getting thrown at the so, game is a part of the game. So then that's when the coaches or the parents get involved. So listen, you don't do that every time. No, you don't do it at all. No, 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 so no, 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 not every time. I, because it's emotion and passion. So how you want to tell a kid not to do it every time? When you, it's like, so, you, so, you can't coach them to, oh, you do this sometimes, but you do that sometimes. It, it sometimes. happens. They're humans. Not everybody is Tim Duncan who doesn't barely show any emotion during the game. Okay, but you can also tell a kid, like, we don't do that. If you teach them from a young, if you teach them from when they're young to not to do certain things, It'll carry over. Just like when they teach you a pick and roll. You set a screen, right? Yeah. Do you, do you turn it back to the ball? Mm-hmm. Do you turn it back to the ball? Yeah. Okay. But yeah. you know that's from a kid. Yeah. So if you if you do that when you were a kid, when you get older, have you ever turned it back to the ball on the screen? No. Yeah. No, exactly. Yeah. So it's learned behavior. You teach kids the right way to do the right things. If you teach them, oh, you could do it sometimes and sometimes. They're going to do it every time. Listen, listen. I don't think they're going to do it all, um, all the time. I think it's a time and a place. But once again, I'm going to stay on my, my statement. It's a passionate sport. It is a passionate sport. It's a sport. passionate and emotional sport, especially when you're trying to win. Now, one thing, I won't condone it when you're joined, when you're up by 20, 30, 40 points. That's not, that's poor sportsmanship. So you're telling, so, so. I'm, I'm all for it in a, in a, in a, in a close game, in intensity, a rivalry game or whatever. I'm all for the join. I'm all so for is it. But it's poor sportsmanship when you're up by 20, 30, 40 points and you just, just outright just being a you know what to the opposite team. So that's what I'm saying. So, okay, kids. It's a time to play. It's okay. You could talk people. You could do this. You could get in someone's face. Yeah, yeah. As long as the game is close. But when you're up, be professional. Don't yes, get in the yes, face. Yes, of course. No, how does it make sense? How are, you, how are you telling kids to do? How are you telling kids? It's okay. Get in someone's face when you're losing or when, you're, when it's tied. But when it's up, be respectful. Dial it back. They're not going to do that. Listen, listen. That's, I not, think that's not realistic. If you, if you reiterate, right, and you set the expectations and the rules and the philosophy, philosophy of your team and stuff, they will understand that. You just got to preach it to them. I, I, just to I, teach I, them. I don't, I don't agree. I, okay. I, I, I disagree. You're wrong. I, no, because you're they're wrong. human. They're human. And that, we and do it too. That's, and that's, when we play ball, we yell. Yeah, yeah, all of that and stuff. We're going to tell me not to do they're it. They're human. And that's exactly why they're human and they're kids. That's exactly why they're not going to do that. Time they're not going to dial it back. They're not going to dial it back, man. They they, they were doing it in practice yesterday, throwing the ball, throwing each other. You listen, see you, you see it first I'll be with them, too. I'll be you doing it, too. But end. listen, if you feel like it's too much, Coach Pye, yo, listen, fellas, stop doing it. That's it. No, no, what I do, I call text. So my kids do that. That's what I do in practice with my kids. When they do crap like that, I call, I give them a technical. And they're like, why did I do it? I'm like, you talk. And even, that's not right. You don't do that. And you're going to lose. 
That's another thing. You can lose a game like that. True. So why would you? Why you say always oh, acceptable? It's acceptable. You can do it sometime. No, you can't do it at all because if it's a close game and you do that, you score an and one. You score a layup, right? And one, you have to go. Oh, tank. So if it's a tie game, every tie game, you miss the free throws. The other team go down and make the free throw. That's game. What do you want to say then? Not are you, 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 you want to say it's okay? Yeah. Are you want to say it's okay if your team loses it like that? Are you want to say it's okay? I will yes or no? Up. Yes or no? Would you say it's okay if you lose because your kid, your kid got a technical for doing that? I'll say yes. It's okay. What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? Uh, there no, is no, you. There is no, there is no way, I'm there is no way because I understand your authenticity. No. You have to have self control. No, and there's, not every rep is going to call it. And yes, every rep is going to call it. No, it's not. No, it's not. Every rep is going to call it. Call and call even it. in the NBA, it. it's becoming soft too. Like, come on, stop the stuff they're doing. They're going to call it, whether you agree with it or disagree with it. They're going to call it. You cannot. There's no way in the world. If you're in a game, yeah. a playoff game, a regular season game that could tell me you go to the playoffs or whatever, and a kid gets in another kid's face, toss him and does this, and he gets a technical, and you lose on a technical free throw. It's no way you're going to lock him and say it's okay. You're going to do it. It's okay. There's it's a, time a, place. You're not doing this will that. be a lesson taught, a lesson learned. Like, yo, listen, and, 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 and depending on the ref, and the, definitely if a ref understands the tempo is a pass in the game, okay. I would expect the rep to hold the whistle. There is no way. But I'm telling you, not every rep is going to call that. I promise you not. Because they understand the game. And the momentum. It's a passionate game. You love the game. Energy, blood, sweat, and tears. Let's go. I'm going to tell you why a ref at a younger level is going to call it every single time. Because they're like, if we don't nip it in the bud now, it's going to get out of control when they get older. So we accept that now. They're not going to It was a kid on the floor humping the ground when he made a shot. They gave him a tech. Tech. Got him out of there. Come on, bro. They getting these kids out of here because you got to teach kids the right way. But it's like saying, oh, he's, he's still a little bit now. He's still in my pocket a little bit, but I ain't going to say nothing. No, you want to get on him now because you're like, yo, you're not going to do that when you get older. It's going to get only, it's only going to get worse. You're wrong. Because you're 100. Tell you're right. I'm like, tell us, I'm like, I'm going to tell us this right now. Tell us in the comments right now. And like Denzel Washington said, and remember the Titans, let the boys play. Let them play, ref. Let them play. Let them play. Let the boys play. Man. That's it. It's over. Y'all let, let us know in the comments. Y'all let us know in the comments how yeah. old Dre is. Yeah. Tell us how pro wrong pride is too, man. Make sure y'all like, it's comment, passion. subscribe. We yeah. appreciate y'all. Do that. My boy. Easy style, my Always boy. Always a pleasure. Like, like, comment, subscribe. Let's get it. Hit us up on YouTube, youtube.com. At symbol. Can't fake the tape. You got it. Make sure you hit us up on Twitter and. No, TikTok. not Twitter. TikTok. Yeah, yeah, TikTok yeah. TikTok and Instagram. Can't fake the tape. All one word. Let's go. Peace. Peace. That was a good one. That was good, boy. You bugging, bro. You bugging, bro. I'm all for the toxic. I'm all for it. You're you know, all for it. You're, uh -uh. you're wrong. You're completely wrong. There's no way in the world you will let that happen. Listen, listen, listen. This is why we got the take. You know what I mean? We can't agree on anything. You feel me? No, no. We don't, it's not about but agreeing. But, but we, dis we disagree. That's but fine. My, my thing is, though, it's the past. I understand, though. But no. it's a time and a place, though. No. It's no, it's there, for that, it's no time. No, no. So, all right. So, your girl, your, your daughter, right? Yes. You feel me? Your daughter's playing for Eastside, right? Yeah. Kennedy, 47 or 47. Kick it to her. Kennedy is packed. The okay. whole town is packed. Okay. You on the front row, Janella, yeah. all of us there. Yeah. Tight game. Everybody's talking junk. She hits the three and throws up this side. You tech. Gonna tell her? No, you gonna get mad at her? If she get a tech, yes. Oh, yes, they all tell her. I'm like, no. If she she yes. oh, I mean, I am one three pointer. Yes! Oh! Yes. I'm like, God, like, what no, are you no, doing? No. That's a tech. No. You wanna get a no. tech? And then, alright, so she does it. I don't think every rep is gonna call her. Okay, up. she does it. Loses the game, then what? What? Okay, so, okay. Yeah. Camilla scores. I know. So look, I'm, I'm not there for some reason. You and Janelle are there. Okay, right? cool, cool, cool. Okay, it has my niece. I'm going okay. crazy. Okay, okay, you're yeah, crazy. Yeah. Boom. She hits, she hits a, a layup. They're down, they're down by one. She hits a layup. And one! She go crazy. <laughs> tech. Right? She makes the free throw. Right? The other team gets the ball back because she hits the free throw. They, yeah, yeah. They, hit, they, hit, they hit their free throw. Yeah, yeah. So now the game is tied. Yeah. They um two seconds left, they come down and lay it up. Oh, because she was she got the tech and she got thrown at the game or whatever, and it laid up. What are you gonna say to her in the car? Good shot. No, you're not. You are like, yo, you were wild and you lost the game. No, bro, I, I think every I think that's gonna be a good one. The comments gonna talk about
I think, but also too, show the video of the kids doing the thing. Yeah, no, I'm yeah, sorry. Yeah, I'm I'm sorry. Sorry. You know what I mean? And stuff like that. That'll be good, though. Yeah, you're wrong. No, bro. yo, you're wrong. It's two left feet, boy. <laughs>